Hello friends, and welcome to Fright Night Files, and welcome to Add Tony's. We played the demo the other day, and I said, if I like the game, I'll play the full game. So without further ado, let's do it. Now I know how to make pizza as well, you know? I, was, I wasn't so good at that in the demo. <laughs> but this time, I know how to do it. Look at how beautiful this game is, right? Got some awesome graphics. Okay, we already... Okay, this... There's much more in the... In the coppers this time. They were empty last time. Let's take some coffee. Put it in the coffee machine. Oh, now we need a cup. Okay. Where's the cup at? Here's one. Okay, it's a little different from the demo. Nothing beats a good cup of coffee in the morning. Am I right? Or am I right? I'm definitely not left. So, I must be right, right? Right? I should check my emails. Yeah, let's do that. Mailbox. You can read this, you can pause the video and read this. I read this already in the demo, so... Sup, cuss! Alright. Exit. Hello? Who's, who's at the door? Hello? Someone standing at the end of the door. I knew that would happen. <laughs> Let's hide in the toilet again. Can we take a shower this time? No? Can't even shower before going to work. The demo, I couldn't open this door. Can I do that now? Nope. I can't play the guitar. Nope. Is there anything we can do in here? Not at all. I really don't really feel like going out there. That dude standing there. But we have to, right? We have to go to work. You know? Oh, I remember this elevator took forever. Forever and ever. And if you haven't seen the demo, this game is creepy and scary as F, you know. Jump scares at Libitum. And we love it. Maybe we should... No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Close the door to the apartment. It's just a game, man. It's not like someone's going to steal my stuff. <clears throat> I'm so excited what this... What the game will bring, you know. It's gonna be awesome. The demo was awesome. The stove has a mind of its own. Check it often. I will. Okay, we're at the pizzeria. Hello? Hey, cuz, how are you doing? Hey, cuz. Sam wanted me to call you and give you a quick rundown for your first night. First thing you gotta do is grab the dough in the kitchen. We prepped it earlier, so you should be set for the night. Wood is under the oven, throw in a log to start cooking. When someone makes an order, it will pop up on the computer. You also have the menu there in case you forget which ingredients go in each pizza. All right, that's it. I have to say, because you have some guts coming for the night shift. With all the stories about Tony, I wouldn't want to be there. Anyway, see you in the morning. Oh, this place is supposedly haunted. But is it really? Let's find out. 
Let's get the dough in the kitchen. Okay, last time it was here. Now it is in here. Take a tray. Can I close the door? Okay. Guess not. Check the instructions on the computer. The, the instructions are good, you know. Secret. Okay, Owen got it. Pilova Galore 2000 Pizza Oven. Make extra crispy pizzas, eh? Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, to reduce the risk of personal injury or property damage when using Galore 2000, basic safety precautions should always be followed, including the following. Read all the instructions. Okay. <clears throat> Keep away from children and people with less than 100 IQ. Alrighty. I think I can check that off. Do not add any petrol-based liquid directly in the oven. Well, of course. Do not attempt to climb inside the oven for any purpose while it's above 400 degrees. Check. Do not fall asleep while using the oven. Okay, so we have to put box inside. Check temperature using our temp gun. Ideal cooking temperature between 400 and 460 degrees. Pizzas will cook in 60 seconds. And we have a timer. Awesome. Know how to make pizzas now. What is this secret execute? Oh. Need a password. There's no password here. Okay, password is PWD. Test note. Alright. We have a calculator if you ever need one. PWD. Let's check it out. Eh. Maybe it's just password then. Right? Okay. Guess not. Damn it. Throw three logs of wood in the oven. Will do. Here we go. Hey, we got an order. Orders. Okay. Last time I thought we was making a pizza for a customer called Linda. It was actually the pizza that's called Linda. And we should have here tomato sauce, onion, and mushrooms. Let's take the dough. Let's roll the dough. Let's, let's take the rolled dough. Put tomato sauce, onion, and mushroom. And that's it. Let's check the temperature in this one. Okay. Need another log. Can't we keep this or something? 440, that's, that's alright. Take the pizza peel. And put in the pizza, eh? And then timer for 60 seconds. We're making pizza now, man. How awesome is that? Can we close this now? Yeah. So nice and quiet in here. Yet. I can assure you, it's not gonna keep being quiet and nice. Have you ever noticed how slow time goes when you're just standing around and waiting? One minute takes forever, man. Okay, let's just stay ready to pizza peel. Come on. Two, 
One. Let's go. And put it in the box. Close the box. Take the box. Oh. Let's avoid the trash bin. If you go close to it, we throw the whole pizza in there. <laughs> Let's not do that. And now, we're waiting for the delivery guy. Here he is. In the demo, I thought that sounded like a chainsaw. You know? I didn't know it was the delivery guy. I thought this was going to turn into the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Hey, man. Hey, where's your helmet, man? Take it. Hey. Okay. None of my business, I guess. Hello? Hey, cuz, good job on your first pizza of the night. Thank you. So from now on, you will get orders on the computer. Just take them as they arrive and try to get them all done. I will. Okay. There are some other things I need to tell you. In the last couple of weeks, some weird stuff started happening, like kitchen equipment turning on by themselves, and we got a few leaks in the bathroom. If you ask me, I'm sure it's just some goofball who forgot to turn off water back there, but my mother insisted I brief you on this. Simple stuff, really. Just check the kitchen and bathrooms for anything suspicious. Easy, right? Okay, check Previous the kitchen and bathroom. The, shift, you know? the crazy dude that jumped off the roof said there were some ghosts messing around in the pizzeria. We don't believe in ghosts, right, cuz? The last guy jumped off the roof. He went nuts in here, maybe. Okay, let's check the toilet and the kitchen often. Everything's normal in here. Hello? Oh. Electricity is not great. Alrighty then. <laughs> yeah, everything's normal in here. Hello? Anyone taking a shit? We will read that later because I heard some orders coming in on the computer. Let's make some pizza, eh? Orders. Need a capricciosa and a cachoa. <clears throat> Let's start with the capricciosa. Oh yeah, I need to... Look at this. Uh, capricciosa. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, ham and mushroom. Alrighty then. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, ham, and mushroom. And it's just full mozzarella, mozzarellas. They're not even shredded. Okay, let's put it in there, man. And turn on the timer. And make the other pizza. While we wait. It was a uh, cachoa, tomato sauce, mozzarella, ham, pepperoni. Okay. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, ham, and pepperoni. I could put this one in now, but then uh, I only have one timer, you know. We have time, we have 10 minutes to make each pizza. Let's just wait around. Make sure that this is warm enough. I'm pretty sure it's not warm enough now. Damn it. I forgot to do that before putting in the pizza. And now I put too much wood in and it's burning. <laughs> do you think it's finished? Yeah. Looks like it. Let's throw in the other pizza. Turn this one on. There we go. Oh, wow, Jesus! She 
scared the shit out of me, man. Holy toaster. Hello? Is there anyone back here? Holy mother of Moses, man. She scared the F out of me. Okay. Am I getting crazy in here? Oh, how's the temperature? Oh, that's good. Nice and warm. Okay. What? What was that? What the F was that? What? Who turned on the stove? Hello? Okay. This place is most definitely haunted. The David guy. Oh, he's coming there. With his chainsaw. Yeah. Hey, find your helmet, man. Put on a helmet. Crazy son of a bee. Biatch. Okay, phone's ringing again. Don't bother me. Uh, well, I'm at work. Hello? Hello? Let me guess. You're the new guy. The guy they picked to make the pizzas. Yeah. Noticed anything weird yet? Yeah. I bet you have. See, I called you tonight because I was almost certain they wouldn't end the night shift. There is nothing more important to the Falcos than money, and you are now milking their golden cow. I used to... Well, I used to make the pizzas during the night shift. They oh. probably told you I was insane or other stupid lies about what made me do what I did. There I thought they said he jumped off the roof. And I can help you survive. Well, you could just run away and never look back. If you're even slightly like me, though, you want answers. How about I help you stay alive while you pursue them? Yes, please. Perfect job. Everything was just perfect, yeah? Now, how does Italians do? Perfect. I'm sorry. A dream? Hello? What's going on? Hello? I haven't played this, the, the, the demo ended uh, with that first episode there. Hello? Music's coming from over here somewhere. From 909. Hello? Oh, I don't want to go in here. There's a jump scare right ahead. No? Okay. Turn off the radio. <coughs> Dear Journal, in just seven weeks and three days, my fate will be sealed in marriage. Am I enough? Will I manage to be a good wife and mother? He doesn't like talking about the past. He's kind and considerate today. But what of tomorrow? Will I end up suffering like my mother? Could it be the dreaded Falco's curse? Doomed to a disheartening marriage and ill-fated death? I miss our father so much. They all suggest celebrating at the pizzeria for my big day. Yet, even though I despise that place, its every corner, its every corner echoes our family's disarray. The bricks may not be the same. They scrutinize me regardless, holding us accountable for past and future wrongs. I ache for him 
but resent recalling him in this manner. Sadly, it seems the only way I can. Perhaps for the sake of one last goodbye we shall gather there and feast so he can be with us. Annabelle. Okay. Annabella? Oh, oh, oh. oh, let's hide in the closet. Oh, I can't. Oh. Elevators are always safe. Should make some coffee, eh? Okay, that was it for episode 1. Stay tuned for episode 2. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. Until next time, bye bye.